Hello students and welcome back to bankexamstudy.com. My name is Ramandeep Singh and today we are going to do an important session that is related to the government schemes related to banking. So students, every year, uh, whenever I see any journalist officer or any credit officer exam uh, for scale 3 or scale 4, we are teaching for that from a long time. Coffee time se padha rahe hai, and we see a lot of questions from government schemes. Even in the recent Bank of Maharashtra uh, 2023 exam, jo 22nd of Jan ko hai, January ko, 2023 ko, we saw a lot of questions from government schemes, right? So that's what we are going to de uh, going to teach today. Let's start the session. Before starting, let me tell you, Central Bank of India SO Scale Three, Scale Four, uh, course, uh, course by Ramandeep Singh. It's me. We have already started the classes. We are providing complete video classes, the notes, the test series, and proper quizzes and live sessions. We are providing the course on bankexamstudy.com. This is my WhatsApp number and link to join the course is available in the description. Please check the description, okay? Let's start the session with the Sukanya Smriti Yojana. Very important and very popular. Let me just hide myself. Very popular scheme, the Sukanya Smriti Yojana for the girl child. So the parents or the uh, legal guardian can open uh, the Sukanya Smriti account. It is an investment scheme for a girl child whose age is below 10 years. So first of all, this is important. This question was asked in the Bank of Maharashtra Journalist Officer exam. Okay, 2023. This exam has come here. Now recently, last week exam has I guess up to 8-10 hours now. So girl child of age below 10 years, they are eligible, right? And one... Uh, you know, parents who have maximum two girl child ke naam pe account khol sakte hai. So one parent or one guardian can open the Sukanya Smriti Yojana account for two girl child. So if there are more than two girls, if there are three, four, five girls, then for them Sukanya Smriti uh, account cannot be opened. But there is a catch. Uh, if there are twins, pehli girl hai, then there are twins. In case of twins, three accounts can be opened. Okay. So, uh, this is the eligibility criteria of the Sukanya Sumriti Yojana. Why it is, you know, better than a normal FD? First point, the 7.6% interest rate is there. Attractive interest rate of 7.6% and which is going to be increased in the future most probably and this interest is fully uh, exempt from taxation. Koi tax nahi lagta is pe. It is tax free. Whatever you are investing, it is tax free under section 80C. The interest that you are getting is tax free. At the time of maturity of the scheme, the money that you are getting is also tax free. Okay. So minimum investment is 250 rupees. Maximum you can invest 150,000 in a year. If minimum amount is not deposited, the penalty is 50 rupees. 50 rupees ki penalty hai. What do you mean by triple tax benefit? What do you mean by triple tax benefit? Whatever the principal is invested, uh, us pe aapko ATC milega. That is, uh, you know, tax exemption wahan pe milega. Interest is tax free. Maturity amount is also tax free. Okay, so you are getting triple tax benefit. What is the maturity date and when, uh, when you can close your account? What is the withdrawal facility? That is important. Deposit in an account can be made till completion of 14 years from the date of opening of account. When you have account open, you can pay for 14 years. And the account shall mature on completion of 21 years from the date of opening of account. Account open hone ke ikke saal ke baad, you can close the account. In certain cases, you can close the account even before uh, the maturity. That is 21 years ki jo maturity hai. Usse pehle, you can close the account in two cases. Uh, if, uh, you know, in case of her marriage, if the girl child got married, obviously not girl child after 21 years, she'll be an adult. If she got married, then account, you cannot continue the account. Okay. What is the withdrawal facility? Paisa kab nikal sakte hain? To meet the financial needs of marriage expenses, okay, or higher education, 
इन दो केसेस में द अकाउंट होल्डर कैन अवेल द पार्शियल विड्रॉल फैसिलिटी आफ्टर अटेनिंग द एज ऑफ 18 ईयर्स गर्ल चाइल्ड का एज 18 ईयर्स हो गया है एंड फॉर हर हायर एजुकेशन और फॉर हर मैरिज द अकाउंट कैन बी यू नो यू कैन मेक प्री मेच्योर विड्रॉल्स ओके सो इफ द बेनिफिशरी इज मैरिड बिफोर द मेच्योरिटी ऑफ अकाउंट लेट्स से द गर्ल चाइल्ड इज एट ईयर्स ओल्ड वेन द अकाउंट इज ओपन सो ट्वेंटी वन ईयर्स प्लस एट ट्वेंटी नाइन सो इफ शी गॉट मैरिड एट द एज ऑफ ट्वेंटी फाइव लेट से द अकाउंट विल बी क्लोज यू हैव टू क्लोज द अकाउंट ओके द नेक्स्ट स्कीम विच इज एक्चुअली वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट द प्रधानमंत्री सुरक्षा बीमा योजना एज अ नेम सजेस्ट सुरक्षा बीमा सो इट इज एन इंश्योरेंस स्कीम एक्सीडेंटल इंश्योरेंस स्कीम ऑफर्स एक्सीडेंटल डेथ एंड डिसबिलिटी कवर ये एक्सीडेंटल डेथ और डिसबिलिटी कवर प्रोवाइड करता है एंड द प्रीमियम इज जस्ट ट्वेंटी रुपी पर मेंबर पर एन एम ओके इट यूज टू बी थर्टीन रुपीज बट नाउ इट इज ट्वेंटी रुपीज बढ़ा दिया द एलिजिबिलिटी क्राइटीरिया द स्कीम इज अवेलेबल इन द एज ग्रुप ऑफ एटीन टू सेवेंटी सो इफ यूर एज इज बिटवीन एटीन टू सेवेंटी ईयर्स एंड यू हैव अ बैंक अकाउंट देन यू आर एलिजिबल ओके automatically your uh, the premium would be deducted from your account from 1st of june till 31st of may uh, the your premium uh, the premium is valid okay so jo date hai policy ka that is 1st of june to 31st of may okay payment mode jo hai that is online and the risk coverage which is important please remember that 2 lakh rupees for accidental death or full disability and 1 lakh rupee for partial disability वॉट इज पार्शियल डिसबिलिटी एक लात गई एक हाथ गया दैट इज पार्शियल दोनों हाथ गए दैट इज फुल डिसबिलिटी ओके दोनों टांगे गई तो फुल डिसबिलिटी ओके सो टेबल में बताया है बट दैट्स वॉट इट इज अटल पेंशन योजना वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट वेरी पॉपुलर स्कीम सो एलिजिबिलिटी क्राइटीरिया एज बिटवीन द एज एज क्राइटीरिया इज एटीन टू फोर्टी ईयर्स so age criteria done must own a saving account he must have an a saving account this is the eligibility criteria so as per the information 5 crore people in india has registered for atal pension yojana 5 crore log register karwa chuke hain for atal pension yojana so what are the benefits that they get a guaranteed pension between 1000 to 5000 rupees वंस दे अटेन द एज ऑफ सिक्सटी ईयर्स एक बार साठ साल के हो जाते हैं तो एक हज़ार से पाँच हज़ार रुपये तक का पेंशन मिलता है ओके सो जो एंट्री है एटीन टू फोर्टी ईयर्स तक वो एंटर कर सकते हैं इन द स्कीम एंड द पेंशन वुड स्टार्ट एट द एज ऑफ सिक्सटी ओके आई डोंट नो आफ्टर द एज ऑफ सिक्सटी आज से बीस साल बाद दो हज़ार तीन हज़ार की क्या वैल्यू होगी बट दैट्स वॉट इट इज प्रधानमंत्री जीवन ज्योति बीमा योजना it is open it is available to the people between the age of 18 to 50 if you feel there are certain changes changes let me know i'll just mention that in the pinned comments okay if there is any error in case वैसे तो होगी नहीं in case so pradhan mantri jeevan jyoti bima it is available to the age group of 18 to 50 years okay so 18 to 50 years ka age chahiye and the death benefit or uh, that the insured get is 2 lakh rupees 2 lakh rupees ka uh, jo death benefit life cover milta hai theek hai so no maturity benefit and the premium is 436 rupee per member it used to be 330 but now it is 436 rupees auto debit ho jate hain account se paise so nps very important num uh, important scheme students kuch additional tax benefit milte hain uh, which i'll discuss in the next slides Eligibility criteria change हो गया है 18 to 70 years so it is a sort of investment scheme with additional tax benefits right so as similar to PAN right PAN what is the purpose of permanent account number that is your identity for income tax department okay similarly for NPS there is PRAN permanent retirement account number so PRAN का full form is itself an important question कि प्रैन का फुल फॉर्म क्या है सो वट यू कैन डू इज यू कैन ओपन देर आर प्रोवाइडर्स आई गेस फॉर एग्जाम्पल कोटक इज अ प्रोवाइडर आई सी आई सी आई आई गेस इज अ प्रोवाइडर सो वट यू कैन डू इज एच डी एफ सी इज अ प्रोवाइडर 
so you can open uh, the nps account with let's say kotak and then maybe after 2 years you feel like the manager is not doing well you want to switch to icici you can do that because you have your pran you have your permanent retirement account number you can switch okay so that is the purpose of uh, the pran it is very easy to track your investments okay eligibility criteria 18 to 70 years it used to be 60 years and 65 and now it is 70 years okay so there are two types of nps nps tier 1 and the tier 2 in today's session we are discussing only tier 1 okay uh, so in the tier 1 the lock in period lasts till the subscribers age is 60 years old so if you start your investment at the age of 30 years your lock in period is actually 30 years Premature withdrawals are obviously allowed, but there is a, a lock-in, a long lock-in period. So that is also a problem. So minimum contribution in tier 1 account is 500 rupees. Okay. It is backed by government of India. Please note that. So the tax benefit that you get. Uh, see students, ATC ka benefit is there. ATC ka 1,50,000 rupees benefit is already there. Over and above that limit, under section 80 CCD, okay, 50,000 ka additional benefit is available. So if you are investing additional uh, money in the NPS, you'll get the additional benefit, additional tax benefit. Okay, same goes for the salaried employees. So for salaried employees, you can invest up to 10% of your basic salary plus dearness allowance and uh, into the NPS scheme. Okay. And for self-employed, you can invest up to 20% of your gross annual income and claim tax exemption under Section 80 CCD uh, if you are a self-employed. So that is also to be remembered. Uh, salaried employed ke liye 10% of basic salary plus DA ka invest kar sakte ho. That is the upper limit. For self-employed self people like me, I mean 20% of the gross annual income can be invested. Okay. Employer contribution benefit is capped at 7.5 lakhs for NPS, PF and super notion. Okay. So withdrawal uh, 60 years sakto, there is lock-in period, but premature withdrawal is allowed. 60% of the see once you uh, attain the age of 60, aapki age 60 hogi, or even at that point of time, you cannot withdraw the entire money. You can withdraw 60% of the corpus total amount ka 60% you can withdraw and 40% minimum 40% ka annuitization or the monthly pension what do you say you need to uh, keep that money 40% money for the annuitization. So complete withdrawal is allowed if the corpus is below 2 lakh rupees. Okay, so this is the guideline partial withdraw tax free withdrawal is allowed for 25% of own contribution, 25% of own contribution after three years of lock in period, three times during the entire tenure. So you can withdraw 25% of own contribution after the lock in period of three years. And you can make a tax free uh, withdrawal, you can make that partial withdrawal three times during the entire tenure. Okay. Kisan credit card important scheme actually by the government of India for the farmers. So, I mean, it's a kind of revolving credit for farmers uh, so that they can meet their short term credit needs. So if somebody asks that question at the time of interview, this would be a great answer. It's a revolving short term revolving credit product which can help the farmers to meet their short term credit needs. Okay. For cultivation of crops, dairy animals, fisheries, poultry, all uh, these uh, agriculture and the dairy farming related personals, this particular scheme is available. So to provide post harvest expenses, day to day expenses, their working capital expenses, their own consumption requirements, right? The farmers, they make money once in a year, twice a year at max, but they need money for, for their own expenses. In, during the entire year okay so eligibility all the farmers individual joint borrowers who are cultivators tenant farmers or lessees sharecroppers self-help groups joint liability groups all these are eligible for the kisan credit card what is the limit 
the cc limit is sanctioned for 5 years right and the interest rate is actually very low <coughs> this is very important limit up to 3 lakh rupee uh, you get the interest at the subsidized rate of 7% and if the farmers they repay their loans on time 3% subvention would be provided and 2% subvention would be provided to the bank okay so very important 7% interest rate and 3% is the uh, you know subvention that is provided mudra loan very important uh, <coughs> pradhan mantri mudra yojana very important what is the full form of mudra micro unit development and refinance agency it has changed the entire you know ecosystem for micro credit in india okay so loans are provided uh, from 50000 to 10 lakh rupees three types of uh, loans are there teen tarah ke loan hai shishu loans up to 50000 rupees 50 lakh hazar rupaye tak ke loan uh, for kishore 50000 to 5 lakhs tarun 5 lakh to 10 uh, 10 lakhs right so documentation ka difference hai for shishu uh, less documentation is required for kishore some more documentation is required for tarun lot of documentation is there okay so documentation card difference hai for uh, these shishu or kishore scheme utni documentation nahi chahiye okay so eligibility indian citizens who have their own business plans for service sector activities or trading or manufacturing and require the amount up to 10 lakh rupee they can apply for mudra loans okay so age criteria 18 to 65 years most of the loans in india if your age is more than 65 years you are not really eligible for any sort of loan in india any consumer loan even for the mudra loans for 18 to 65 years is the eligibility age for mudra loans okay benefits banking and financial services can be availed both in rural and urban areas financial backing can be obtained by micro and small business and startups business loans can be taken borrower credit guarantees taken by the government of india uh, the food vendors shopkeepers small business owners can make the most of uh, most of it you know they can make make most out of the scheme before 2014 right even before the bjp government when the scheme was not available it was very difficult for shopkeepers for small food vendors to avail credit facilities they were borrowing money at the rate of like 5% per a month yes you heard it right 3% 2% per month but under the scheme very low interest rate is charged so that is why this scheme is very beneficial i hope you like the today's session and you are able to understand the various government schemes for banking <coughs> sorry cbi central bank of india specialist officer scale 3 and scale 4 courses are available on bankexamstudy.com we are providing the complete video classes we are covering the entire syllabus with the help of video classes the notes the test series we are also providing the live sessions and quizzes this is our whatsapp number if there is any doubt in your mind ask your doubt link to join the course is available in the description please check the description and join the course right list of our successful students these happy faces they took our courses and they cracked their respective exams they got successful in their careers i'm really really happy for them right so all of these students they took our courses in the past and they cracked their respective exams i'm really really happy for them if there is any doubt in your mind always ask your doubts and we are going to answer your doubts that's all for today students thank you and have a very nice day bye